Democratic presidential candidate Julian Castro is making his first campaign stop and swing through Iowa. The former San Antonio, Texas mayor and Obama administration staffer making a half dozen appearances in Siouxland, including a private party in Sioux City tonight. Castro is one of more than a dozen Democrats lining up for the party's nomination in 2020. Castro calls himself the antithesis to Donald Trump and is not taking money from PACs or federal lobbyists. Because I want to make sure that Americans know if I make a decision, that decision is going to be made because I believe it's in the best interest of the people of this country, of Americans, and not because somebody's contributing to my campaign or anything else. The Democratic field of contenders is still wide open with no obvious frontrunner. Castro's Iowa itinerary has him working across party boundaries. You know, he came from Orange City. Uh, he's going to go to Buena Vista County. He's going to some of the areas where Democrats don't do that well to say we're, we're a party for everybody, every county, every state. And I think that's the type of courage you need. In all three Democratic hopefuls have events planned in Siouxland tomorrow. Castro will meet with folks in Storm Lake at Better Day Cafe. That's tomorrow morning. Here in Sioux City, Colorado, Governor John Hickenlooper is holding a meet and greet at Pier Street Coffee. That starts at 10. And then tomorrow evening, New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio will host an event at Rebo's. That gets started at 5. Kamala Harris will be making stops in Des Moines as well as Eastern Iowa, uh, Eastern Iowa tomorrow.